From mid-2021 through mid-2022, as part of the Strengthening the Implementation of Responsible Fatherhood Programs Project, or SURF, MDRC worked with 10 fatherhood programs that tested approaches to recruiting and engaging participants. They did so using a process called Rapid Cycle Learning, in which programs use data collected during implementation to determine changes to their select approach. That process was done in three to four cycles throughout the year. The three approaches being tested were coaching, outreach, and peer mentoring. The coaching approach to case management differed from what fathers or staff members might be used to. Coaching, uh, when we first was introduced, was kind of hard and challenging. You know, we was doing more hands-on case management type. Because if you think about it, these folks are, who are in our programs are working with other social service agencies, other programs, other resources, and they have case management. And they're used to saying, hey, Mr. John Doe, take this here, go here, do this, one, two, and three, call me in the morning. Departing from traditional case management, the coaching approach lets the father lead the process of setting goals. You know, you're the passenger and they're the driver in the car of their life. So we're there to support, but we're not there to guide. You come to our program, they're like, Hey, Mr. John Doe, what do you want to talk about today? What do you want to do? What is it that you need? And, and show us how we can help you. Some other techniques used are open-ended questions, providing affirmation and reflection of the father's statements, and other methods to encourage the father to identify and talk about his needs. It built confidence in the dads. It made them take back their life in a sense that I can do this, and it, it gave them um, ability to say, wow, I accomplished this on my own. 